Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make this pretty little flower for next to nothing. The first thing you need to do is grab a toilet roll and rip yourself off 10 sheets. Stack them into a pile and pop a mug on the top to draw a circle for you to cut around. When you're cutting out your circle, you don't need to worry too much about making the edges neat and tidy. The flower is going to end up quite ruffled around the edges, so it won't show up any imperfections. Now you need to separate your toilet paper back into the 10 separate sheets. One thing you really need to look for is these little jagged edges. We do need to cut those off because we're trying to make a flower that looks nice and soft and those edges will stand out. Okay, so now we've got a nice little petal. Let's grab a cup of water with our little paintbrush and let's start putting some water into our, just our watercolour paint. It's like a little kid's painting set. And just touch it onto the edge of the paper. The great thing about this is it requires absolutely no painting skills whatsoever. And that's my kind of painting. As long as you keep plenty of water in the paint, it'll create that nice watermark around the edge. Okay, so now continue on and do that with the other nine petals until you have a nice stack. Pop them together and then get something sharp and very carefully poke a hole through the middle. Then we're going to grab what's called a brad and that's going to poke through the middle and come out the other side like that. Then we're going to grab a little piece of cardboard that I cut out earlier, poke a hole through that and poke the brad through the hole too. Then you can separate the little legs and that holds it all together nicely. Now you can ruffle your flower up and make it look the way you want it to. Other options are to get white toilet paper and make other little flowers out of them. They're so quick and easy that you can experiment with all sorts of colours and see what suits you the most. Well, I hope you enjoyed that tutorial. Thanks for watching.